Hi, hello and welcome to this Android Basics course by iNeuron. My name is Ankur and I have around 11 years of experience developing apps for both Android and iOS. This basics course is designed for someone with zero to little knowledge in programming, for someone who wants to kickstart his Android development using Kotlin. In this course, I will take you through a brief history of mobile development, installing Android Studio, creating, building and running your simple app slash game, and then publishing that app on the Play Store. On the way, we will also learn about some basic Android concepts such as activities, fragments, and recycler views. Before we start with the course, a bit of a history lesson. Today, when we talk about smartphone operating system, we can only think about Android and iOS. But before them, there were many companies who tried their hands on building a good smartphone operating system. Most memorable of them was the Palm OS with the Palm Pilot phone. Launched in 1996 as a personal digital assistant or PDA, this Palm Pilot was meant to be a personal information management device. Even in 1996, it came with apps such as calendar, date book, address book, and even handwriting recognition. You could also synchronize your data with a desktop. Then in 2001, Steve Jobs launched the iPod, which actually laid the foundation for the launch of the iPhone six years later in 2007. In the same year, Android also announced itself to the world under the Open Handset Alliance umbrella. Gradually, Android overtook the sales of iOS and now is the most sold operating system in the world. Now, while Android was built from scratch to allow developers to use the smartphone OS capabilities to build apps such as accessing contacts, accessing the camera, iPhone was built to only allow web apps. But one year later in 2008, Steve Jobs and Apple announced the iOS SDK which kickstarted the apps revolution and today we can't even imagine our lives without these apps. The app revolution was so huge that there were queues after queues of people lining up to buy their brand new iPhones and Android phones. If you are interested in learning a bit more about the history of the first iPhone, there is a video on YouTube called The Struggle of the Original iPhone by the channel Cold Fusion. So this is it for the history lesson. In the next video, we'll start installing our studio and help you on your way to start developing apps. Thank you for watching.